back at Robot Wars' 20th anniversary, I had planned and filmed a very special episode of the Grand Slam to commemorate the occasion. Robots from the classic and modern series, the champions of those series, were all competing for the ultimate prize of Champion of Champions. Imagine the All-Stars if all the All-Stars had won a tournament. But you have not seen this episode. Why have you not seen this episode? It would have been such a good thing to release. Well, unfortunately, all the footage, all the graphics, everything was lost. All of it disappeared and I don't know where. And that was really disappointing, really heartbreaking. And uh, so it was just lost to time as something that just didn't really happen. But with the channel about to hit 1000 subscribers, I thought it was high time that I refilmed it with a twist. This time 12 robots from competitions such as Robot Wars, Battle Bots, King of Bots and the Grand Slam itself will be competing for the Contest of Champions trophy. In this tournament, only the best can survive. We'll see robots such as Panic 2, uh, Chaos 2, Razor, uh, Tornado, Typhoon 2, Apollo, Carbide, Eruption, as well as Bite Force and Tombstone. And from King of Bots, we have Spectre from the Grand Slam, Shadow Cat. Those are the 12 competitors. But who will be fighting who? Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the draw for the Grand Slam Contest of Champions. Today uh, we are doing the draw to see who will be fighting who in the opening rounds. The way the format of this uh, episode will work. Start with four three-way battles. One robot will go through from each. Two two-way fights. So like one one-on-one. One-on-one. That's the heat semi-final. And then there will be the final easy sorted simple so six fights six fights seven fights total um so in melee one without further ado let us begin we'll decide going and as you can see on screen it is spinning and the first robot to be drawn is chaos two chaos two obviously the winner of uh, robot wars series three and four uh, they are a flipper, very powerful, did quite well in Grand Slam Series 1 as well. Looking forward to seeing how well they do in this tournament. The next competitor will be... Tornado. Rivals of Chaos 2 from the Grand Slam. They were in the same heat together uh, and they managed to get flipped out of the arena by the floor flipper. Um, they're hoping to rectify that situation have a proper tussle with chaos 2 in this one but there is a third robot going to be in this fight and that robot is bite force oh very stacked bite force the uh, battle bots 20 years 2015 2018 and 2019 champions they are in their uh, original format of the grappler because uh, I'm not yet bringing in the vertical spinner version of uh, Bite Force. It is a plan for the future, but not just yet. Okay, in Melee 2, we have the following robots. Spectre, my first build for 2020. Uh, so new that you've not yet seen it in a more robots video. It is coming uh, at some point, probably. Um, so yeah, Spectre, Crusher, one King of Bots, Series 1, um, awesome robot, absolutely love it, and yeah, who are they going to be fighting? Let's find out, shall we? As we spin the wheel again, we see Tombstone, so a bit of a rematch once again between um, a Team Robo Challenge robot and Tombstone, we saw... Uh, Quantum, the BattleBots counterpart, faced Tombstone in the round of 16 in BattleBots 2019. Will this be some retribution for Team Robo Challenge? The third robot and final robot in Melee 2 is Shadow Cat. They're not going to be happy about that one. Or maybe they will be. They get to face a lovely spinner but also they can fit very easily into Spectre's jaws. This could be a very rock, paper, scissors fight. Um, 
any one of those could take that one. Obviously, Shadow Cat Series 1 champions of the Grand Slam. A very uh, well-deserved winner there and deserving of being in this contest of champions. OK, Melee 3. We have the following robots. We start with Carbide. Yes, Carbide, the mighty bar spinner who took the Robot Wars Series 9 champion title. They were runners-up in the series before and the series after as well. Possibly the um, best record of any Robot Wars robot in a long, long time. Probably since Chaos 2, I'd say. Although, I don't know, I'd, I'd argue they did better getting to th all three of the modern grand finals. Next, we have Typhoon 2. This is a spinner-heavy fight so far. Typhoon 2, sometimes deemed controversial winners of Series 7, but they won Series 7 nonetheless. That is history, that is fact, and therefore they are in this, uh, and they are facing Carbide. Who is the final robot that they will be facing, though? Let us find out. It will be Apollo. So a rematch once again. Apollo and Carbide, old, old rivals. And actually, Team Typhoon, Gary Cairns, who had PP3D, is an old rival of Apollo as well. Bit of a grudge match then, that one. Which means we lastly have Melee 4 and the three robots that are going to be fighting in this are Panic 2. Don't really need to spin this, but I'm going to anyway. Um, Panic 2, the, the next version of Panic Attack, um, a more modernised version of it so that it can uh, be in the same league as some of these other robots. We also have the mighty Razor. This thing is an awesome robot. They are in their anti-spinner setup for this tournament uh, that we will get to see in the future. Not quite yet. And that leaves the final robot, the robot that technically won the first time this was filmed back at the 20th anniversary of Robot Wars Eruption, the flipper that took the Series 10 champion title. So there we have it, just a little recap. In Melee 1, we have Chaos 2, Tornado and Bite Force. In Melee 2, we have Spectre, Tombstone and Shadowcat. Melee 3, we have Carbide, Typhoon 2 and Apollo, and Melee 4 we have Panic 2, Razor and Eruption. Place your bets in the comments below who is going to win this tournament. You will find out when the channel hits a thousand subscribers or soon after anyway. Recording will be next week now, I'm putting it back to uh, a week after the weekend because one of the robots isn't actually at my house also i'm not actually at my house so i can't get it at the moment so i need to sort that out first bring it home and then we'll crack on with the tournament itself thank you all for watching and i look forward to seeing you again bye bye